네, 안녕하세요. 호승입니다. Hi, I'm KD from England. 안녕하세요. 제 이름은 조아입니다. 미국 사람이에요. 오. 안녕하세요. 보보입니다. <웃음> <웃음> 정말 낯선 조합. 낯선. <웃음> 아니요, 처음이에요. 전 공항에서 본적 있는 것 같아요. 오늘 주제는 미국과 영국의 다른 사람. Do you want to go first? I feel you're like British humors. I feel you're British humors. I think a British pronunciation makes everything sound fancier. Mm. Right? I guess it depends on the accent. I guess to us, like, you know, uh, some accents don't sound so fancy, oh, but to like everybody else, they think like, oh, it sounds pretty fancy. <laughs> yeah, I mean, I don't have any problems with the American accent. I like your accent, but you know, like, uh, there's a lot of jokes. Like American people make a lot of jokes, like, oh, British people, I over pronounce and stuff. <laughs> but we're like, hey, it's all language. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> What's the difference between like northern side and the southern side of England? Yeah, of England. Oh, it's so different. And I'm from the north. Mm -hmm. So, you know, London is the standard. Mm -hmm. And then northern has more of like a twang to it, especially where I'm from, because we're right in the middle of... Mm -hmm. Apparently, there was a lot... I feel like I'm giving like a full history. <laughs> <laughs> it's almost the same like America, though. In the south, you have more of like a country accent. Yeah. And then like, in the north, you like sound like you're from Boston. Oh, <laughs> Boston, all right. Oh, I love that accent. <laughs> Well, I find like a British accent, it's more like it sounds more proper. I feel more comfortable using yeah. American accent. Yeah. yeah. But I find it really, you know, like proper, sexy. Yeah, more, like, I agree. Yeah. <laughs> Thank you. <laughs> I think that like uh, a lot of people are used to the American accent, and I think as well it's a lot easier to pronounce with American because I think like American accent has like the flow mm -hmm. to it, like your letters roll. Mm -hmm. So it's definitely a lot easier for people to listen to and pronounce as well. Whereas um, the British accent is very like, you know, we Steve. pronounce very much every syllable. Yeah, every syllable. <laughs> I also really like to see when like Americans and the British people get into like, an argument. Or, like, <laughs> oh, we do that a Stop lot. Smiling. Don't fight it. Don't fight it. <laughs> like, First what word. is your way? Like, I say tomato. Tomato. I say tomato. 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 It sounds fancy though. Yeah, I know. Tomato. Can I have a slice of tomato, please? Tomato. Just, <laughs> tomato, you know, tomato is like sounds like like it's more sweeter, but tomato likes more sour. Hango. Mm. <laughs> <laughs> Korea. Tomato. It's kind of similar with like mm. tomato. 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 Mm. Oh! <laughs> the famous one! I love it! Water! <laughs> exactly the same. <laughs> no. I'm joking. Okay. So we... No, I say water. 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 You say water. Water. Oh, you're just talking about them. Theater. 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 Hangogun <laughs> Yongwa Gajumi da. Yongwa Gwan. Yongwa Gwan. Yongwa Gwan. That's Korean language. This is an education video. <laughs> like, let's go to the theater. Tomorrow, my friends and I will go to the theater. So, you're pretty up there. Theater. Sounds good. How do you support? Or do you need the space? Ah. Oh! I guess so. 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 Is it called the loo too? Loo. Yeah, Slam. you can say the loo. Like, the loo is specifically the toilet. You can just find when I pop the loo. Uh, yeah, oh. I go to the loo. In Canada, they use washroom. We say bathroom. But in the military, we say like latrine. Mm -hmm. Oh, latrine. I think, <laughs> I think it would be like all right to say, but I think, you know, like, uh, especially like British older people, they love to like make fun of whatever you say. So if you say that you're going to the bathroom, they might be like, oh, what are you going to the bathroom for? <laughs> <laughs> you know, if you just need the toilet, they might say that. So you're like, mm. <laughs> The room is a bath. Yeah. <laughs> so I think it's better just to say toilet so that they don't make uh, any kind of stupid joke. I was in the bathroom in the bathroom, but the restroom? Restroom for me sounds like really formal. Like, may I use the restroom, please? Uh, <laughs> you know? I have to use the restroom. Uh, <laughs> uh, 
first floor and ground floor. For me, it's like common sense. If you enter on the ground, it's ground floor, mm -hmm. and then you go up one floor and that's the first floor. So mm -hmm. that's how we say it in England. Mm -hmm. But you guys don't have ground floor, do you? Do you? Really. you just I mean, say we like do, first? but we usually just say first floor. Yeah. Yeah. Like ground floor would be like parking lot. No, because that's basement, because you go underground. It's basement too, but like... <laughs> <laughs> but, but in Korea, you, know, the guys, you, you, know, you guys already know that there's no fourth floor. Yeah. It's the sometimes in Korea. Yeah, <laughs> we, we don't have that. Yeah, we don't have that superstition or anything. <laughs> yeah, it can be confusing, like, especially here, because like, obviously I never had any problem in England, because we all say the same thing. But when I came here, if I tell them, like, go to the first floor. Um, they could totally misunderstand. It's like the lobby. <laughs> yeah. And I know that I get like still confused sometimes about it. So like if they'll tell me to go to the second floor, I'm like, which one is it? <laughs> Where am I going? <laughs> Even today, I was like, I've got confused. Oh yeah, it's like <laughs> your, our, our studio is located in second floor. But it's not, it's one floor. Where did you go? Like, So I was like, because I waited for the lift for ages and I was like, yes. oh my God, this is taking ages. The elevator. And then yeah. <laughs> I took the lift and it just goes up yeah. one. So I was like, that was lazy. And the lift was packed too. Yeah. <laughs> I had to like fight my way yeah. just for one floor. They must have been thinking, she's so lazy. It could be confusing. Downtown and city center. Mm, downtown and city center. With an R first. Centre. 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 I think that comes yeah. from French, that spelling. I think so. The R. -y. We say city center. Really? Mm. Center. I've never said downtown. For me, that sounds like really American. <laughs> <laughs> downtown. Downtown. <laughs> yeah, we say city downtown. center. With an R first, not E R. Is it R? R E. Yeah. R first. Oh. I think that's the European spelling. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That's oh, the yeah. European. French, they French. Also yeah, yeah, that's where we get it from. Centre. Centre. Well, yeah, I think downtown sounds like really, really American. Really American. <laughs> I've never heard someone say that before. Like, we just don't say that in England ever. Oh. If somebody says that in England, like an English person, they'll be like, Foreigner? <laughs> <laughs> where did you come from? <laughs> but how about. So you don't say city centre? No, never. No? <laughs> oh. <laughs> the reason it sounds strange to me, I've literally just realised this, the reason it sounds strange is because like downtown is a town, like not the city, because I'm from a town, I'm because I'm not from Liverpool city centre, mm -hmm. so if I want to go to Liverpool, I'll say I'm going to the city centre. Mm -hmm. But if I'm going shopping in my town, I'll say I'm going to go downtown. We actually do say that, so I lied. Mm -hmm. <laughs> 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 Downtown, like in Korean, hard for Koreans. Yeah. So, so downtown, I was like, uh, 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 Uptown Girl. Uptown Girl. I didn't know that. Uptown Girl is downtown. Girl. Oh, that's really good. Korea's cookie. Korea's cookie. Oh. Korea it's cookie. Oh. It's Different. That picture is a cookie. Cookie. Yeah, that's oh. cookie. But if it doesn't have chocolate chips, it's not a cookie, it's a biscuit. It's a biscuit. Really? <laughs> oh, yeah. oh, just different, different, different. So anything, you know, like that shape, that texture is a biscuit, and we call that a cookie. In America, mm -hmm. we call like biscuits, biscuits. I know. Yeah, no, it's <laughs> crispy. 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 Yeah, crispy. Oh. I was horrified when I, that was so dramatic, but I was horrified <laughs> <laughs> when I saw biscuits and gravy, because I was like, yeah. when I heard it, biscuits and gravy, who's no. eating that? <laughs> Because I'm thinking about our biscuits, like shortbread biscuits with gravy on top. And I was like, that is <laughs> bizarre. Mm. And then I saw the photo and I was again like, what is that? Because it looks like a like a scone. Plain. It's like, like bread. Yeah, like yeah. Not, not sugary, like yeah, not yeah, sweet. Right. So I don't know this, why I call it French fries. Yeah, like, this is this is something that bothers me. Knows. <laughs> 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 oh, French fries are not French fries. French fries. French fries. Because French fries and chips are, I feel like I'm so opinionated. <laughs> uh, French fries and chips for me are totally different things. Um, French fries are like, you know, McDonald's thin style ones. And then chips are like the thicker, fluffy ones. Um, and then, you know, like, I know that you guys say chips for crisps. Because uh, oh. you say like potato, potato chips. chips. Potato chips. Yeah. Potato no. chips. Mm. Yeah. What do you think about when oh. you hear like French fries? French fries is so normal for an American. Mm. Do you say fries. it for like the thick ones? I say for too? every kind of yeah. French fry. Mm. Like, you know, we have wedges, garlic yeah. fries. Tater tots. Tater tots. Tater tots. I love tater tots. Waffle fries. Mm. There's so many French fries. Mm. I love them. Potatoes are a majestic yeah. thing. Yeah. <laughs> oh no. 
I feel like this is gonna cause some arguments. <laughs> <laughs> wow. Oh. Oh. I thought it was gonna be aluminium. Uh, <laughs> so waiting for that one. Check and check. Check and check. Like put the meaning, you know, check. You can have a check or you can check for something. Oh. Like, or you can check the check. You can check the check. 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 Color with a U. Color, color and color. This always confuses me. Mm. Even like, Does that like sometimes I'm spelling color and I'm like. The gray, color, you know? Like, color. Yeah, gray. Yeah, gray. gray. Was gray, it an E or A? E or A. Yeah. Oh! I know, yeah, now, now we, we actually learned something today. Look at you, England must be EY oh, and EY. you're AY. Yeah, right. When I read it, like on the screen, yeah, EY looks more natural to me. It, looks, it feels like familiar now that I've seen it. So, but no pronunciation difference, I think grey, grey. Grey. Let's put A just the spelling. Grey. Grey. Tire, but I. Tire and tire. Tire and tire. Tire and tire. Tire. It looks weird for me <laughs> with the I. Tire. Yeah, it looks a bit strange for me to see it that way because I just think of when I read that without seeing the picture, I would think of two different words like tire to be tired and tire is in uh, real tire. If oh. I saw it like this, I wouldn't have thought that tire was. A wheel. Tire. Oh. Yeah. Aluminum. <laughs> aluminum. <laughs> what? What's the difference? What's the difference? We say aluminium. Aluminium. And you guys say aluminum. Aluminium. 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 You say pajama. 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 I've never saw the pajama. word. Pajama. So the right ones. I never see that. Yeah. I think like <laughs> in French, it's the same spelling. Like uh, maybe pajama. that's where we got it from. Mm. Pajama. I write it like the right, but I kind of pronounce both. I think pajama, pajama. But in Korea, it's pajama. Pajama. We have like a slang word, and we say jammies. Jammies. Oh, we say jammies. Jammies. <laughs> 네, 오늘은 영, 영국식 영어랑 미국식 영어를 비교하는 체험을 해봤는데 재미로 비교하는 겁니다. 저희들이 전문가가 아니고요. 영국 영어도 이제 다양한 지방의 영국 영어가 있고 또 미국 영어도 다양한 미국 지방의 미국 영어가 있으니까 그러니까 너무 이제 복잡하게 보지 마시고 재밌게 보셨으면 좋겠고 그러면 구독과 좋아요, 알림 설정, 댓글까지 부탁드려요. <웃음> <웃음> 제발 안녕. 안녕.